Hello viewers, how are we doing? This is your boy King Mox Lion, your daily presenter. Today we are having a very important topic that we are going to talk about. These are two topics. As we go for the first topic, it's going to take place and it's going to be about sugarcane. What is it about sugarcane? Wait, I see. What's your name? Uh, my name is Derek. Oh, Derek? Yeah. Um, I need to ask you this one. Do you chew, do you drink or eat sugarcane? Sugarcane? Yeah. Uh, sugarcane, I think you, you you chew, then you drink sugarcane. You do both at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> you eat sugarcane after you drink. Eh? But, but but I think the one you're spitting out is sugarcane, not so. Uh -uh. What you're spitting out is what you've gotten out of sugarcane. Is what you have gotten out of the sugarcane. Yeah. <laughs> that, that, that's what you're drinking. That is what you're spitting. Yeah, that's what you spit out. So you mean that white one is rubbish? That is rubbish. After but I think that's the real sugarcane we're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> you first eat, then after you drink. What you, you had, what you spit out is not sugar cane anyway. It what is, is rubbish. It? it is rubbish. <laughs> it is rubbish. You know sugar cane. Yeah. But when you, but you like you, you squeezed it from it. Eh? Hey, you squeeze the sugar cane. The, you the squeeze soup. the sugar cane. Uh, me, okay, the, the to soup. me, to me, <laughs> to my own understanding, I think sugar cane is the soup. The rest are not sugar cane. So sugar cane is a shoe. Yeah, yeah. So you, you drink sugar cane. You, you drink it and the rest you pour out of the mouth. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> Let's get to my this Derek. <laughs> What's your name? My name is Ronita. Oh, what a beautiful name. Now Ronita, I need to ask you a question. Do you eat or drink sugar cane? I swallow. <laughs> <laughs> you swallow sugar cane? Mm -hmm. You mean like after eating it with that uh, the, the other person before was calling soup after taking the soup inside you 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 swallow also the sugar cane as well yeah it, like for it you, has some proteins it has some protein but it will grow in your stomach no it has never grown that's why I'm giving you it's out of experience it's out of experience eh? mm -hmm. so you swallow sugar cane yes I swallow <laughs> sugar cane <laughs> yeah, thank you so very much for being with us Ronit what's your name I'm Zebra the Jibori girl. Oh, Zebra the Jibori. This name is Tafo. Uh -huh. Now, Zebra the. Yeah, Zebra. Uh, do you eat or drink sugar cane? I do both. You do both? Yes. It's quite funny. Mm -hmm. So, you do both? I do both. Okay. So, let me say, for example, if you drink sugar cane, you mean you also swallow that uh, white thing? I don't swallow because it's rubbish to me. Oh, it it can't even damage my body. You get hey, they can damage your body. Yes, so you especially social, my you heart, my lungs. Eat and drink. I both eat and drink. Cause I drink, I drink the other water. You think it? Huh? Hey, the water. <laughs> Somebody before was calling it soup. <laughs> That's you're calling so, it water. It is water, <laughs> not the other water. You know about water. Oh, water. Sugar cane water. Oh, it, 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 thank you for sharing with us. What's your name? I'm Sharifa. Oh, Sharifa. What a nice name. Ah, uh, Sharifa. Do you eat or drink sugar cane? I do both. Hey, you do both? Yeah, I drink and eat. You drink and eat sugar cane? Yeah. So what happened to that uh, white thing they throw out? It becomes useless in my mouth, so I can't just enter it because it's useless. It can even damage my stomach. Hey, yeah. So what is that white thing that people throw out, like the one for the sugar cane? That white one. It's a, I think it's a wastage. Hey, it is a wastage. <laughs> so it is a wastage. Yeah. So you eat and drink both of them. <laughs> eh? Okay. Sharif, thank you for sharing with us. Hello, viewers. This is your boy King Mox is still. Uh, behind me, this is what we call Busa Ten. What's your name? My name is Sony Samuel. Oh, Sony Samuel. I need to ask you a very simple question. Do you do you eat or drink sugar cane? I eat. You eat sugar cane? No. Are you sure? No. You, you, you said before you eat, now you said no. Which one is the correct answer? No. You don't, you don't eat sugar cane? No. What do you do with sugar cane? You eat. You eat sugar cane? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so it is, a, it is a no, no, no thing. You are yes. confusing me here. Yes. Do you eat or drink sugar cane? You eat. You eat sugar cane? Yes. And after that? Yeah, because drink. what I know with the sugar, you, yeah, you eat it after that you drink. Yeah, you drink. Oh, so what happens to the other white thing that people are spitting out? Yeah, you put them out. You put them out just like that. Yeah, <laughs> it becomes manure. It becomes manure. Yeah. Eh? Yeah. Yes. So sugar cane is manure. The the the, the remaining the remaining uh, put it. Oh, that that carabish. Yeah. You you put it as a manure. Yes. Oh, thank you for yeah. sharing with us. Yeah. Thank you. Hello. 
Hi. What's your name? My name is Sandra. Yeah, Sandra, you're so tall. Oh, I think I'm chasing something. You can see tomorrow for us. Eh? Yes. Okay, Sandra, uh, a teacher, scientist, and politician, who is spoiling the world? Scientist. <laughs> Why? They're overbringing their things and we're not understanding, so the world is all confused. What are you not understanding? I think it's too much of science now, we're not living there. Too much of science? But the way I look at science, even the gadgets we are using like this one, even right now that we are streaming on the TV, it is a science, not so. It's science, but people don't understand this. It is better you just talk. But now, now what is this? I don't understand what it is. You don't know what it is? No. Oh, so scientists spoil the world. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, thank you so very much for being with us. <laughs> What's your name? I'm Isaac. Oh, Isaac. I need to ask you, Mr. Isaac. Ah, uh, teachers, scientists, and uh, politicians. Who is spoiling the world? Ah, uh, most definitely teachers. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Uh, these people keep teaching kids the other things which have expired already. You are talking about the other things. Which things you mean? Mm. You know, you know. These days we are in the developing world, yeah. Uh -huh. So they should think, teach things that are advanced. You know. When the technological world teaching us history and those things has no use for us right now. So we are in the past, yet we are in the future. Hmm. Hmm. So when a person teaches you a, a foundation about your past for you to know your roots, he is spoiling you. Yeah. Why, why are you telling me that thing which has happened in the past? We need to know how to do things for the present and for the future. So the past has, you know. Yeah, definitely teachers. So in another way, you are trying to say the teachers are all this. They are just teaching things that happened long time ago. Exactly. Now the knowledge I have is the same as my grandpa. So we have no difference. <laughs> ah, this is funny. This is funny. So you are you are you are taking yourself as your grandpa right now. Yeah, we have no difference. So he, he knows we have been learning algebra and they have been learning algebra. So there's no difference between them now. So in other ways, algebra even started before them. Before them. So we are still learning the past. So we're in the future right now. So so we need to learn things that are technological. Oh, thank you, Mr. Isaac. Yeah. Thank you so very much for being with us. <laughs> yeah. And we are going to get another viewer. What's your name? Uh, Richard Ushime. Oh, Richard Ushime. Uh, now, I have a very serious question on you. You look to be someone who is good. Eh? Uh, a politician, teacher, and, uh, and a scientist. Who spoiled the world? Ah, the politician. Why? Uh, because what they do, they always maybe sometimes kill people who are good and uh, sometimes they do things that are not good. Are you sure? Uh, some... Because what I know politics even started from the Bible, whereby it's not all about killing. So <laughs> politics is all about killing for you. Uh, politics before used to be different than the one that's applied these days. Oh. So you think the people spoiling the world, they are the politicians? Yeah. Not a teacher, and, not a scientist. No. And also another thing, scientists also are doing some bad stuff by <laughs> bringing in some viruses and some other things that, uh, you know, hey, they are spoiling also the world also. So you are trying to talk about the COVID-19 indirectly. <laughs> thank you for that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Richard, thank you for being with us. Yeah. My name is Charity. Oh, Charity. Hey. I need to ask you this question. Teachers, politicians, and uh, scientists, who is spoiling the world? Teachers are spoiling the world. Teachers? Yeah. How? Because they're the ones teaching the upcoming everything that is coming out. So everything, everything is their fault? Coming, everything that is coming into the world is for the teachers because they're the ones teaching us. Oh, so you mean all these things that are happening right now is it is teachers' fault? Yes, it is teachers' fault because they don't bring the upcoming what generation. Upcoming generation. Yeah. So you are trying to say teachers teach scientists, they teach politicians, Everyone. and it brings problems. Exactly, that is what I mean. <laughs> teachers are teaching the politicians, teachers are teaching the scientists. Now they are confusing the whole world. Everyone is confused. We are in so between teacher and the, and all of us, who is a confuser and who is a confusing? The teacher is a confuser, and for us, I don't know where we fall. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so very much for your charity. Hello viewers, I have these two wonderful people with me, of course, as you know, ladies first. Hello. Hi. What's your name? Leo. Oh, baby. Ah, uh, hello. Hi. What's your name? Leon. Oh, Leon. That, so we have Leon and baby. So I'm going to ask me, teachers, politicians, and scientists, who is spoiling the world? Why, do you think so? <laughs> they are very proud, right? Eh? Like who? Standing next to one. 
Oh. <laughs> okay, uh, Leo, uh, sugar cane and uh, do you eat or drink sugar cane? Mm? You eat sugar cane, don't drink it. You eat sugar cane, don't drink it. What happened to the water with the sugar? The water you are inside. The water? Hey. You swallow it. <laughs> you swallow water? <laughs> oh, this is nice. <laughs> this is nice. <laughs> My first time of knowing that we swallow water today. You swallow water. You swallow water, you don't drink it. You swallow it. You swallow it. Wait. Oh, this is interesting. <laughs> and then Leon and Mimi, thank you people for sharing this with us. All right. Yeah. So ladies and gentlemen, we have come to the end of the program today. Uh, remember, this is 2R1 Area Code Movie Productions. Uh, you'll be with us, share, drop the link and subscribe. Don't forget to drop your comment. I am still your presenter, Kim Oxlade. Till then. <laughs>